My thanks is huge. You, you can't keep everything in your head. But now I can look up on Wikipedia. If it's a theorem that I kind of remember, I can just look it up you know, within seconds. Um, and this has really sped up my, my own research. There are now also these, these very um, uh, interesting um, sort of more crowdsourced type, type collaborations. So um, I've been involved in, in a, a type of online collaboration called um, polymath collaborations, for example, which I run online. And they're open to, to anyone can participate. And we, we have you know, dozens or and sometimes even, 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 even hundreds of mathematicians um, all um, try to work on, on, on one problem, not trying to race to, to, to solve it, but to work collaboratively. Everyone just makes um, one observation, one remark, and, and then tosses it out there, even if it's half uh, baked, in fact, especially if it's half baked. And then, um, and then someone else may, may critique it. And, and, and so it's rather chaotic and fun, actually, but it, it, it uh, um, but it, it can be very effective. Uh, there, there, there are certain problems which would have taken, you know, years for and and, be, and, be, and of, of, of if you had sort of conventional teams of mathematicians attacking the problem. But by by by, by sort of crowdsourcing um, 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 these efforts into one single program, we could do things a lot faster. There was this 80-year-old problem of Erdős um, uh, regarding the, uh, what's called the discrepancy of certain sequences of plus and minus ones. Um, and uh, there was no progress on this problem basically for, for decades. Um, and about five, six years ago, um, uh, a colleague of mine, Tim Gowers, um, started a polymath project to attack this problem. And they, they, they got many people, including myself and many other people, trying all kinds of, of different um, ways to simplify the problem, transform it, um, and make any progress at all. And um, they didn't solve the problem, um, but they did manage to make uh, a, a number of key observations. They, had, they managed to simplify the problem to um, a, a, a smaller problem, which was they still couldn't solve, but it, 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 it was progress. And then they got stuck. Um, uh, but then this year, there was some additional breakthroughs um, in, in number theory by some other um, uh, young mathematicians. And I was able to use these new breakthroughs combined with these, these older reductions of the polymath project to finally solve, solve this problem. Um, so it was really important that actually that, that there was this, this online collaboration before. Um, often, if it, if it was uh, the work of just a single person, they may not have published the type of um, partial progress that, that uh, the polymath uh, group uh, made. But because that was all open, I could, I could use it and, and, and use it to, to finish this problem.